Hi everyone, today I want to show you how to fix and unify back-facing polygons. So let's see the first example. Here we have a sphere which has a, a uh, weird artifact of uh, back-facing polygons. So let's see what's going on. Let's uh, switch to polygon mode, press Ctrl A on the keyboard to select everything. And as you can see, we have a darker polygons uh, which have a... a Back facing normal or normals and uh, the problem is that I don't want to select each and every one of them because it's going to take me a lot of time to do it and I want more efficient and uh, quicker way to do it so let me show you how so let's turn off polygon mode and let's apply a an uh, edit mesh modifier let's switch again to polygon mode press ctrl a again to make sure everything is selected and under surface properties we have unify button let's press on it boom and as you can see all the polygons are now facing the right direction if from some reason uh, all the polygons look like this uh, which is dark uh, you can just need to press on the flip normals uh, button over here and uh, it will flip the normals and turn them to the right direction so let's see a bit more complex example. Here we have a dragon uh, model, which is a lot more dense, as you can see. It has over 2 million polygons, uh, and it has the weird artifact of back-facing polygons. Uh, and I want to show you the way with the, the normal uh, modifier, which is a lot quicker. Um, so it's go like this. I, either I uh, convert it to editable mesh or apply edit mesh modifier uh, I know it's like before but the problem is that the normal modifier don't uh, work exactly the same on edit poly models so we need to convert it to edit mesh and so now let's apply the normal uh, modifier and by default the flip normals is checked I want to uncheck it and to check the unify normals and boom all the uh, back facing polygons are now unified with the others and it's look perfect um, and that's it please thumbs up if you like the video uh, please subscribe and uh, I see you on the next tutorial bye bye